Lucy, darling, you mustn't mind that poor crazed creature. <laughs> I don't. He amuses me. Well, Lucy, how can you? Poor devil. Thank God, it will soon be dawn. Dawn. The ebb tide of life. I hate the dawn. How can people like the daylight? Tonight I'm really alive. Tonight was made to enjoy life. And love. Come to me, John. My own John. Lucy, I'm so happy that you are better and strong again. I've never been so well, so full of vitality. I was only a poor, washed out, pale creature. I don't know what made you love me, John. There is no reason why you should. But there is now. I worship you. Then tell me something. If you love me, you'll tell me. Now don't turn away from me again. You made me promise that I wouldn't tell you anything. Oh, but I release you from your promise. There now. What were you and father, funny professor, doing that? I can't tell you, I promise. You say you love me, but you don't trust me. I would trust you with my life, my soul. Then prove it. What were you doing? Over there in Carfax. With the hammer and the horrible iron sink. You don't think I'm asking you because I'm just trying to find out whether you really love me. So you try to hide your schemes and your plots? Afraid I'd give them away, are you? And you fools! Whatever he wants to know, he finds out for himself. He knows what you do. He knows what you think. He knows everything. Lucy! Let me kiss away the tears. You must. You made me promise not to let you kiss me. You don't know why I said that, John, darling. Because I love you so much. I was afraid of what might happen. You always thought me cold, but I bled in my veins. Ha! Bled in my jaw. And I knew if I were to kiss you, but. I don't understand you. I love you. I want you. Come to me, my darling. I want you. Lucy, Lucy. Hang on, hang on! Save yourself! I want to my book, friend. Thank God. Thank God. Don't come to me, John. I'm ugly. My darling, in my eyes, you are purity itself. You love her, and love there is truth. She is pure, and the evil thing that has ended her shall be rooted out. You said you could save Mina's soul. Mina's soul is in heaven. Tell me how. It is your right to know. Now. I entered her tomb. I pried open her coffin. I found her sleeping there, but not dead. Not truly dead. There was blood in her cheeks. A drop of blood like a red ruby on the corner of her mouth. With a hammer and a stake I struck to the heart. One scream, a convulsion, but then the look of peace that came to her face, when with God's help I made her truly dead. If I die, I swear that you will do this to my body. It shall be done. I swear it. And die. I cannot face this horror that I'm becoming. We will find this thing that has fouled your life, destroy him, and send his soul to burning hell. And it shall be by my hand. You must destroy him if you can, but, but with pity in your hearts, do not rage and vengeance. That poor soul who has done so much evil needs our prayers more than any other- No, you cannot ask me to forgive. Perhaps I too will need your prayers and your pity. My dear Miss Lucy, now, while you are yourself, help me. How can I help you? No, no, you mustn't tell me anything. Every time the white face, the red eyes came to you, you were pale, exhausted afterwards. But, but that last time. Last time he came, he said I was to be his bride. He would seal me to him for the centuries to come. And, and then? And then, 
go. I can't tell. But you must. You must, Lucy. true power. But this I do know. It is eight minutes to sunrise. The power of all evil things ceases with the coming of day. His last earth box is his only refuge. If he can keep him here until daybreak, he must collapse. And the hammer and the stake are ready. Here he is. Come quickly. No! No! But you must, man. This may save your soul, your life as well. No! No, I'm not alone! Find her body, and 
that she will not. Then she shall die by day. <laughs> you, you will kill her. <laughs> you lack the courage, you poor rat of flesh and blood. Silence, John. He is doomed. This is his revenge. He hopes to trouble us afterwards. 30 seconds. I thank you for reminding me of the time, Professor. Hark, open the curtains. That is the east. The sun will rise beyond that meadow there. The clouds are coloring. God's daybreak. A pleasant task you've set upon for yourself, Mr. Harker. Ten seconds. Be ready to collapse this. <laughs> the sun, the snake, Professor. The snake, hold him, Doctor. I've got him! <laughs> That's a bad You heard what he said. I will not permit this. What are you going to do now, Van Helsing? We'll take Brentville and destroy us. Dare we leave Brentville on Earth? Become a slave when he dies? But he's human. We can't do that. I'll do it if you won't, Doctor. Go to your office and get some painless drugs. Where are you going? Master, save me. I am coming to you. Show us the way! Where does that passage go? I never knew there was a passage there. Only that devil has the combination. We'll break through somehow. Hug it quickly the hammer. Ashes to ashes. 